If you're unsure about investing in chunky sandals this summer, stay tuned for today's video. Hi there, welcome to my channel. My name is Sarah and I am the award-winning style coach here to help you refine your style and increase your confidence. Today's video is all about the chunky sandal that we are seeing everywhere right now, but is it the right investment for you? We're going to talk about that today. Before we get started, can I please ask you to like the video and of course subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done so. You can also find out more about my online course over on my website, thestylecoach.ie. So we've got chunky sandals trending this year. They did start around summer 2021, but they are really taking off now in summer 2022. Now, you know me and trends. I am not one to buy into trends just for the sake of a season or a couple of years. When I buy something, I wanna make sure that it stays in my wardrobe for a long time. So if you're following me here, you probably have a similar mindset as well. You are more about sustainability and style over fashion trends. I'd love to know if you've already bought into this trend, whether you're happy with it, whether you think it's gonna stay in your wardrobe for the next few years. So do let me know in the comments below how far you've gotten into this trend already. So how do you know whether to invest in the chunky sandal and whether it will stay with you in 10 years from now, in 20 years from now? Well, there's a few things you've got to consider before taking the plunge into what is being called the flat form trainer, and we'll discuss it here today. Let's first talk about the age appropriateness of these sandals. If you were somebody who grew up in the 90s and, you know, born in the 80s, 70s and before, you'll be very familiar with the idea of platform shoes, platform trainers. So if you're revisiting this, you might feel like it's a little bit retro or it has been done and you feel like you might feel old fashioned wearing something like this. However, if you're somebody who was uh, born in the 2000s, you will feel that this is a new trend for you and it's very exciting. But if you were that person who's experienced platforms before, can you go for it? And the answer is absolutely yes. What it comes down to is nothing really to do with age at all. It's more about your confidence levels and whether you believe you can pull it off. Let's first talk about style personality and who this trend would appeal to. If you are a classic person or indeed a romantic type of person, you'll probably feel like this is too out there, uh, it's too heavy, it's too chunky for your style of dress. So for you, it may not be worth going down that route of investing in a pair of chunky sandals that will only see you through this trend and then you'll be tired of them because it won't fit into your wardrobe next year. So best to stay away from it if you are that classic style or that romantic style personality. Now you don't have to go all in chunky for the this trend. If you are classic, if you are romantic, you can dabble in a lighter pair of these chunky style sandals which will get you through the trend, but also appeal to your style personality and give you that longevity as well. But if you want to go all in Prada, chunky sandals or similar, then you probably want to be something like the dramatic style personality or indeed the creative style personality. I think the fact that you've got a flat shoe here and it's going to be super comfortable, then it's also going to appeal to the natural style personality. So those are the three style personalities I would say these are gonna suit not just for this year, but for years to come as well. Let's now talk about body shape because your body shape, your lateral proportions, your vertical proportions are all going to play a huge role in whether these are going to work for you long term. So let's talk about the lateral proportions and the five body shapes. When I'm talking about the five body shapes, I'm talking about the rectangle shape, the inverted triangle shape, the triangle shape, the hourglass, and of course, the round or oval shape. Now I did talk a lot about shoes and boots that would suit these different body shapes. You can check out that video here. I'll link it up above. 
But in terms of these sandals specifically for summertime, I'm gonna talk about each of the body shapes and who it would work for um, and who it may not work for, but how you might make it work for you. So stay tuned. So when we talk about body shape, generally speaking, we're thinking about creating a balanced look. Now, this is not for everybody because when we create a balanced look, generally speaking, we're moving towards the hourglass shape. Now, somebody decided a long time ago that the hourglass shape was the be all and end all and the shape to aim for. I think that's BS. I think whatever shape you have is the ultimate shape for you. Uh, however, I know there's a lot of people out there who want to create this balanced shape, so I'm going to give you the info for that. Let's first start with the round shape, also called the oval shape, or indeed the apple shape. So if you can imagine, the apple shape is kind of top heavy. They carry their weight on the upper part of the body, particularly around the tummy area and the bust. So all of the weight is up there on the upper half and they tend to have nice shapely legs. They'll often say the legs are the best feature. So in this case, a chunky sandal is really gonna work for them because it's bringing balance down to the lower part of the body, balancing out the upper half. So I think a chunky sandal is actually gonna work great for this person. The very fact that these sandals are platformed is going to work great if you are on the petite side or indeed if you want to give a more elongated figure or a slimmer looking figure, the sandals are going to work great. Let's talk about the inverted triangle. This is also a person who can look top heavy because their shoulders or across the bust is going to be the most dominant feature, getting narrower down through the hips. Because they are, again, a little bit top heavy, a chunky shoe is going to bring balance to that look. So it is going to work for somebody who has that shape. If you are an hourglass, beware of these shoes. They are going to appear quite grounding, quite heavy. They're going to create an imbalance in your already balanced figure. So just be very careful when you bring that heaviness to the shoe that you balance it out somehow with something a little bit fuller on the top. So you wanna avoid something like a very thin strap. Rather, you wanna go for something like um, a t-shirt with a shoulder pad in it, giving that balance to the platform sandal. The rectangle shape is also one you might want to be a little bit cautious of. So the rectangle is very equally proportioned. They are a balanced shape. However, the chunky sandal on the foot can give a very androgynous looking look overall because it's lacking that softness, it's lacking that uh, delicate look that other sandals might give to the overall look. Now, if it's a look that you're going for, this and androgynous look, then by all means, this is gonna be for you. But this is where style personality and body shape come together to give you that perfect formula about whether you're going to be wearing this long-term or not. Let's talk about the pear shape or the triangle shape. So this is the person who carries their weight around their hips, around the bum, and they tend to look more bottom heavy. So by adding in a chunky platform sandal, it's gonna further add to that grounded look, to that bottom heavy look. So I would be cautious about going in full on with this platform look. I would tend to go for something a little bit uh, lighter looking on the foot and then bring balance to the upper half by you know getting that shoulder pad in on the upper half or some interesting detail on the upper half so just be a little bit cautious that you know if you are unsure about this look overall be cautious if you are a pear shape but if you really want to know the secret to pulling off these chunky sandals this year and beyond is nothing really to do with body shape or uh, style personality, it comes down to your confidence. And I say this about pretty much anything you wear. I always say if you have the confidence from the inside, there is absolutely nothing that you cannot wear. You can pull off anything, but you've got to go out and you've got to own your style. And I've demonstrated this over on my Instagram page, the thestylecoach.ie, where I put on a plastic bag and made it look something because I've got the confidence to do it. So that's what it comes down to here. You know, you can think all day about, okay, proportions, vertical, lateral, and style personality, and getting that all coming together, which is great. But if you don't have the confidence, you're gonna go out and you're gonna try and be hiding away and be unsure, and it won't pull the look together. So whatever you choose to do this year in terms of your trends, in terms of your style, wear it with 
confidence. If you'd like to know more about your individual style and your body shapes and proportions and what looks fantastic on you, do get in touch for an online consultation with me. That's it for today's video. I do hope you enjoyed it and learned something new. If you did, please give it a like and subscribe to the channel and I'll see you again next time. Take care.